Yo guys, so up on parachute today, one of the windiest days I've ever experienced and we're on our way to explore one of the areas called Guthiga. So pretty stoked to check out more of the parachute terrain, ride some trees. Should be a good time. We're getting it guys. This may be the windiest conditions I've ever been in with my snowboard. Oh, we've got some uh, nice smooth snow here. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's a bare spot. Oh, windy. Gotta look out for these sticks. Oh, hey, hey. Uh oh. Tight, son. I don't know where we're going anymore. Woo. Whew, that was pretty fun, right? I think this is uh this is the most real tree riding we've gotten yet. It is. This is no joke. We've lost our tour guide, Enrique. Enrique! Rick! Dude, prime example show the bark on the gum trees. Look at that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's like camouflaged. Yeah. Should we try to find Enrique? You! Okay, where are you taking us next, man? We're heading off to Outer Limits through the trees so as we come back through. Uh, so you get lots of slush, uh, lots of fun rides, lots of snaky turns. So, should be good fun. Sick, man. <laughs> Thanks. That snake run through the trees, really technical, really fun. Lots of little booby traps, uh, holes falling out from below us, little rocks and stumps to avoid. But I think the main thing that I was thinking about while riding through there was finding where I could kill my speed. So when I would see those big bank, big berm turns, I would try to spray some snow at the side. It would kill my speed just enough that I would have the confidence to just continue to ride and yeah, find that next section of clear snow to ride through. Really tough section, especially on a, on a mountain that we've never ridden before with new obstacles, new terrain. But yeah, that was so much fun.
Yo guys, so TJ was going into his pocket, getting a big handful of candy, and he pulled his pass out of his pocket and lost it, but we just spotted it from the chair. It's behind Tower 5. We found it, yep, Tower 5. Should have went for it last lap, but we figured it had blown away with these winds, but we saw it for sure this time. Let that be a lesson to you. If you got a big bag of candy in your pocket, save it for the, save it for the chalet. Just don't put your pass in the same pocket as your candy. <laughs> it's Haribo's fault. Yeah guys, we found this uh, snake run underneath the chair here. Goes in and out of all the rocks. Super fun time running through there. This is a, a place in Perisher that we would never have found if it wasn't for having a guide, a local like Enrique, show us around some of the some of the good spots. Coming down around those rocks, really had to look out for those wombat holes. Every once in a while, you make a hard turn and the snow just gives way, leaving a big hole. Could be a wombat in there, a snake or a koala, all kinds of critters. Finally today, got out to explore more of Perisher. So I was super stoked to check out Guthaga and Blue Cow. And a big shout out to Enrique. Thanks so much for showing us around the mountain today. Uh, Perisher is a much bigger mountain than I had expected. So to have somebody show us the spots made it so much easier for getting around for sure. Yo guys, so on the drive here, TJ was at zero bars on the fuel scale. So we're running on fumes. Kevin! Hopefully we can just coast this whole drive back and make it to the gas station, or as they call it in Australia, the petrol station. Get some petrol. But yeah, if we don't make it, we're gonna have to hitchhike and we'll probably end up having to park beside a bunch of roadkill and get hitchhike a ride with it probably a serial killer. So either we're gonna get, make it to the petrol station or we're gonna get murdered by a serial killer. Either way, it's, uh, it's all TJ's fault. It's gonna be a lot of liters. I was quite concerned, but we made it. On the flashing light all day, there and back. Thanks for watching today, guys. As always, links below in the description to our gear. And yeah, check out the next video coming out soon. Gonna be riding a parachute tomorrow, riding some park. Yeah. Good times. Thanks for watching, guys. See you tomorrow, guys.